Hey folks, Azuski Films here in Tapan Hin Pichit, Thailand. Uh, Tapan Hin is like north central Thailand. It's about five hour car ride from north of Bangkok. And uh, we're coming to the end of a five month hiatus here. We'll be going back to the US in about two days. And we'll pretty much have missed the entire winter there in Michigan. So that's not a bad thing. But anyway, wanted to focus today on uh, making a video on how to change the air filter on the 2014 Honda Forza. I have to say, I think this also applies to the 2015 as well. But anyway, let's uh, head back to the uh, Forza so you can have a look. This Forza has about 15,000 kilometers on it and we've taken several long trips with it. On this, um, during this trip, we took two long trips, one up to Nong Kai, which is about a 10 or 11 hour ride. We did that over a couple days, two up and then um, that was one way and then we have also take it, uh, taken it down to Bangkok which is about a six hour ride on a motorcycle and yeah so today we're going to focus on the air filter which is right in there so uh, let's get started <laughs> All right, the only tools you'll need for this job are a Phillips head screwdriver, an H5 Allen wrench, and some rags and paper towels. There's an air filter in the bell case that you'll either have to clean or replace. You also need another air cleaner. These are single-use filters that cannot be cleaned. Okay, the first thing we need to do is remove the air cleaner housing. There are seven screws we need to remove. Then we'll have to use an H5 Allen wrench to remove three screws holding the bell case housing. And here's a closer look of where those seven screws are. And here we have the bell case air cleaner housing. You have to remove this housing, there's one more screw to remove. Now you can remove the air cleaner housing. This housing was pretty dirty, so I'm gonna give it a wash later. There are three screws holding the air filter in place. The air filter is molded into the single piece plastic. The bell case air filter is sandwiched in between these two pieces of plastic. There are three clips holding it together. This filter is in pretty bad shape, so I'm gonna go ahead and replace it. Here you can see on the inside of the air cleaner box, and there's some oil here coming from the crankcase breather. This is perfectly normal. Periodically, you'll have to empty out the breather drain plug. Here's a look at the new air filter. I'll put the part number in the description below. I mentioned before these filters can't be cleaned, and that's because there's some sticky substance on the paper that traps the dirt. Thank you. 
So I couldn't find anyone that sold this belt case air cleaner. So I decided to make my own using this old face mask. I'm using some double sided tape to get it to stick to this housing. I had to use two pieces in order to get it to wrap around completely. Fingers crossed. Okay, now we can put everything back together. I hope you enjoyed that video and if you did please click the like button and if you want to be the first kid on your block to be notified whenever I come out with a new video please consider subscribing to my channel don't forget to click the bell icon and click all so you'll be notified on every video that I release all right thanks for watching peace out